Today I want to show you something that's a little bit different than what we usually show here at Realty Candy, but I want to show you a client of ours. Her name is Becky Scharf. She has uh, the website portlandscondos.com. So Becky's focus obviously is condos in Portland, and I want to show you something. This is kind of shows the value of you know, a lot of things that Becky's done over the years. One is a lot of work building this website. The second thing is, is that she um, put some emphasis on good SEO. And one of the things I really like about her website is that she has a great domain name. Instead of something like BeckyScharf.com, when people go looking for something, so I'm going to search the web here. This is my uh, Opera browser that I never use, so hopefully it's not um, biased in any way, but I just use it to search for things like this. But if I put Portland condos, like say I'm a, a buyer or even a seller and I want to do something with Portland condos, let's see what Google says. Okay, we've got this great ad from Redfin. Another ad from Portland... Uh, orhomelistings.com. That's kind of a tough domain name, but, but nonetheless. Uh, apartmentlist.com Portland. Okay, then we have Zillow.com. Okay, those guys spent, you know, hundreds of millions of dollars. We have Realtor.com. So we have, of again, these are ads up above here, right? These first three are ads. So the first results that are organic results are Zillow.com. Uh, Realtor.com, and then Becky's website, PortlandsCondos.com. On the page, there's some other players, Apartments.com. Becky outranks them, by the way. She outranks Trulia.com. She outranks Redfin. She outranks, outranks Movoto. She outranks HighRises.com. She even outranks PortlandCondos.com. And she outranks Property Shark on the first page. So let's uh, let's click over here on her website and take a look at what she's got going here. So I'm going to open this in a new tab. Of course, now my computer is going to be biased. Um, I can see that. So we've been working with Becky for, I just looked it up, for almost eight years. In a couple months, uh, and actually in four months, it would be eight years. So she started out with a different design. She updated the design on her website uh, a while back. But you can see that she's got these set up in the way that a person in Portland that knows the market is going to pick something. Hey, I want to live in the Pearl District, or I want to live in the northwest uh, part of Portland. She's got a picture here. I mean, she's got all these areas set up, South Waterfront new condos and townhouse listings, condo open houses. Um, she's just got a lot of uh, information. So I'm going to click on one of these. We're going to go to uh, the Portland condos in the Pearl District. And you can see here she has an image of the Pearl District. She's got a little bit of information about it. And you can see that she's got some links here. Uh, that have some more information. She's got uh, an IDX broker widget embedded here, and you can see all these condos. She's got a lot of condos in here. And, and then she's got some content below the widgets. A lot of people put all this stuff above the widgets. I think Becky did the right thing by putting it, uh, most of this above, um, most of this content below the properties, because when people are looking for this, if I'm looking for condos in Portland, I probably already know all this information about the Pearl District, or I'm really not that interested in it right now. I'm more interested in looking at this condo. So I like the way that she put the condos first. She has some more information down here. And uh, so let's just click on one of these, a, a couple of things up here. One of them that I liked is there's a complete search of Pearl District condos. So I'm gonna open that in a new tab over here. And what that does is, you can see she's got a, this is a saved link in IDX Broker. She's put here what it is. It's a complete search of Pearl District condos. It's given her 196 results. They're ranked by price. And, uh, you know, her users can just click through here and, and see all this information 
um, about the different condo areas. She's actually using one of our free custom templates here and uh, it loads all this information right here on the right hand side so a user can quickly uh, see all this information about the condo. There's all the images real fast. I can take a look at all this. I can see beds, baths, county, you know, the year built. Here's some more information about it. Uh, if I want a printable flyer, I can click here and get that. The layout of this is, is just sweet because as a condo buyer, it has all the information uh, right here at my fingertips. She's got an embedded uh, map here so I can see here's this property, here's Old Town. I, I can just see exactly where it is uh, in comparison to everything. She's got the walk score embedded in here and a way to reach out to her. Um, again, I just think that this is a, it's, it's, it seems, you know, simple, really anybody can do it, but I often tell people it's like, uh, if I need somebody to put gravel around the plants at my house, it's, it's actually really simple the, you don't need a lot of technical skills, but you got to have somebody go do it. Now I can either do it myself. I can try to trick my kids into doing it. I can hire somebody to do it. And uh, Becky's put a lot of effort into this uh, over the years. And as we come back here to the Google results page, you can see that it's paid off for her because she ranks, I mean, she's the number three natural ranking for Portland condos. And that's a great value as a, as a buyer, as a seller you know right away that you're working with somebody that specializes in Portland condos. She's not trying to sell, uh, you know, all property in Oregon. She's not trying to sell every home even in Portland. She's focusing on these um, condo buildings, and she's just got all kinds of information about them. Check it out, portlandscondos.com.